Hey everybody, Massachusetts Prepper here. Today I'm going to do something I haven't done in a while. We're going to do an EDC pocket dump. Okay everybody, well like I said, I haven't done an EDC pocket dump in quite some time. And this is my wintertime EDC. Now, first and foremost, I always try to carry a medical kit with me. When I'm wearing cargo pants, this will be inside one of the cargo pockets. This time of year, I carry it inside my jacket pocket. The next thing that I've been carrying, some of you know, you've seen the video on this little light. This is the Bushnell and this is the 50 lumen and I'm testing this out and I'll be doing a follow-up review on that next thing I've been carrying and I've been carrying this for about a year and I'm gonna be doing a review on this as well this is the Gerber dime I use this people ask me why I carry this and the Leatherman Micra and as you can see it is dusty this has been in my pocket. I carry this one because it's got the pliers on it right here and some other nice things. And I'm going to be doing a review on this and the Micra and let you all know what I think of these after a year of use. Now, of course, we all carry a little bit of money. You know, got some money in your pocket, I'm sure. But... I don't carry money in my wallet. I do carry it in my pocket. This is the Leatherman Micra. This is a nice little pocket tool. And the reason I carry the Micra and the dime is because this one has much better scissors on it. I really like these scissors. They're large enough to actually do something with. Um, and there's a few other tools on this that I like. So, yeah, the Leatherman Micra. Next thing I have is just three keys that I don't have on a keychain because I use these all the time so they're just in my pocket. Now I also have my wallet and this is my Communist Wealth of Massachusetts license to carry. So I'm not going to show you all the pertinent information on there but <clears throat> this wallet is the Spec Ops wallet and I've been using this for about a year now, and I haven't been able to destroy it. I really like this wallet. Um, it folds out quite nice. And I'll just show you Spec Ops brand. Very durable wallet. I have not been able to destroy this. They say if you can destroy it, they'll replace it if you tell them how you destroyed it. I have not been able to destroy it. Okay, that's the stuff that I've got there. Next, a lot of you know this knife. The Spyderco Paramilitary 2. This is an awesome blade. I really like the action of this blade. I've been carrying this thing for quite some time now use it all the time it's just a very nice blade holds up well opens fantastic and closes well very nice blade okay of course I have my Samsung Galaxy S6 which smartphone you know we've all got our phones and then the other thing you know I've always got my fitness tracker and I've usually, 90% of the time, I have a some sort of paracord bracelet or lanyard on me. 
So, you know, that's here too. The other thing that I carry, and for all you safety sallies out there, this is my Glock 23. Yes, it is loaded. Yes, there is one in the chamber. So I'm not going to unload it. I'm not going to drop the magazine. This is loaded. Safety's between my ears. So, you know, for all the safety sallies out there, finger is off the trigger. My Glock 23. Now, I also wear a white hat in the waistband holster that I carry that Glock in. I'm not going to pull it out of my waistband to show it. But I've been wearing this same holster for about five years now. Uh, I can't say enough about the durability and craftsmanship of the white hat holsters. Um, they just hold up phenomenally. The next thing I usually have on me is my jumble of keys for both vehicles. Uh, you know, different keys for different things. This nice little light that I won in a giveaway. Um, this came from Country Prepper, a giveaway that I had won from him. Um, nice stuff. But, so, there you have it, my friends. That's my EDC for this time of the year. Will you survive whatever comes your way? I sure hope so. This is the Massachusetts Prepper saying, take care, all.